Welcome to Rapid Fire. I'm Mr. Hemi, and this week's question is what weird food combinations do you really enjoy? Is taking mashed potatoes and just mixing in the barbecue to make barbecue mashed potatoes. I don't like weird food. Uh, taking the salty combination, like um, breakfast food, making it I'm kind of a picky eater, so no weird food combinations. French fries with mustard. I tend to use mayonnaise where most people would use ketchup, like on hot dogs and other things. Peanut butter and jelly and potato chip sandwich. I'm obsessed with dried cranberries. I put dried cranberries on just about everything. Hello, everybody. This is Mr. D. Simone. Good to be with you. How's it going, Mr. D. Simone? I'll tell you, spring has sprung, and I can't wait for it to continue. Baseball season is here. Let's get it rolling. All right. Yes, I'm so ready for the warm weather and the flowers to begin blooming. Yes, so, it makes you feel good. It definitely does. So now I'm going to turn it over to Mr. DeSimo with some important dates. First, the next refresher session on Thursday, March 31st at 1 o'clock. It is all about our fun, clubs, future ready, and other fun things that you can get involved in here at Achievement House. Next, Guidance wants to remind you that the next college visit will be to Kutztown University. This is happening on Tuesday, April 5th at 10 a.m. Contact your guidance counselor for more information. Let's move on. Another reminder that the second annual virtual talent show is underway. So if you want to get in on it, the act, record yourself performing your talent. Once it's done, email it to Miss Brittingham by sending it to jbrittingham at achievementcharter.com. Your submission must be sent in by Friday, April 8th. Staff members are also welcome to submit a recording of their talent to be featured. Also, we gave you a sneak preview a couple of weeks ago about a couple of fun field trips coming up this spring. For starters, we're going on a field trip to Hershey Park on May 13th. Your permission form and payment is due by April 19th. Go to the main office course to find the information and forms. Now, if you're on the western side of the state, the trip is to Kennywood Amusement Park. All the other information is the same. Check it all out at the main office in Schoology. Wow. All right. I think I got them all now. Back to you, Mrs. Ellison. Wow. That was a lot of announcements. I hope you all caught that. And just a reminder that the quarter three will be ending soon. You have until Sunday, April 3rd, to submit any missing assignments or redoing assignments by 11.59 p.m. Make sure you get those in. So now we're going to show you our special segment for this week. Hello and welcome to our special feature this week. I'm Mr. Hemi and I have with me today, Mrs. Gailey. Hey, Mrs. Gailey, how are you today? I am doing wonderful. Looking forward to the weekend. How about yourself? I am also very much looking forward to the weekend. So I understand that you're helping to organize some college visit field trips for our students. So which students should try to go if they can? I would encourage all students grade nine through 12 to go. It may feel a little early thinking about that in ninth grade, but it's the perfect time to go explore campuses and really get a feel for what you wanna do. So if they go on this trip, then what, do you, what would they get out of uh, going on any of these visits? So these visits are awesome. It's a small group tour. You're really gonna get to see and speak with so many students, individual programs. Um, we went on one tour where we got to see this whole mixing studio. 
So we've really seen some cool things and heard great stories from students that still go to college. What is a mixing studio? That is a great question, still above my head, but I understand that it has something to do with like recording. They've had recording artists there uh, and I have a really, really cool picture of it that I'll be sharing on the guidance page. Yeah, mixing audio and mixing video. That's kind of stuff that I like to do on the side too. So that's, so let me ask you this question. Uh, speaking of going on uh, a trip to see a college, when is the next trip? Yeah, so we have one more trip this year. It's going to be April 5th at 10 a.m. And we're going to Kutztown University this time. Cool. So uh, how can students let you know that they want to go? Sure. So on every guidance page, no matter what grade you're in, there is a link to sign up along with a big image of Kutztown University. All you have to do is go to that form and enter your information. Well, that sounds easy enough. Uh, when's the deadline to sign up for the Kutztown trip? I would say the absolute last day to sign up would be next Friday, which is April, oh goodness, the first. Cool. Well, thank you so much for your time today, Ms. Galley. I really appreciate you sharing all this information with our students. It was my pleasure and hopefully we'll get a few more to sign up and just have to throw this out there. We do get a free lunch at Cookstown, so it was pretty good last time. <laughs> Everybody likes free lunch. Oh yeah. Right, thanks again and uh, until next time, see you later. Wow, that was awesome. Thanks. I really, yep, I, I really enjoyed that. All right. Well, do you have anything else to add for this week, Mr. DeSimone? Yes, I do. I forgot one thing. So there is one more thing to share. And this is something I think many of our students will want to know about. It's the grief and loss group. This upcoming group is being offered to all students because, let's face it, many of us have lost loved ones in the past few years. This is an opportunity to join your peers to talk about and participate in hands-on craft activities that will help you express your grief. If you're interested in more information, please re reach out to your mentor or Ms. Sapko. All right. Well, that's our show for this week. My name is Mrs. Ellison. And I'm Thank Mr. D. Simone. Thank you for watching. Have a great week, and we'll see you next time. Have a good Bye. one, everybody. Bye.